Hello, I'm in a room here with very poor 3G internet signal. I have my laptop with my internet key plugged in and we can see that we're getting zero bars registering on our 3G. On my phone we can see that it's defaulted to the 2G edge signal which is just a voice signal, you can't use data. So that just shows you we've got a very, very bad signal in this room. Now, if I, on the wall over here we can see I have connected the Stellaratus repeater and uh, the panels there and next to it is the actual repeater. I'm now going to switch the product on and we can see that the lights come up and we're getting a blue light which means we've got a data communication going and on the left we've got our signal light indicators and at the moment we're getting four, four and a half bars which is great and the other part of this product is a panel antenna which actually goes outside and I have that outside at the moment. Now if we go back to our laptop we can see that our 3G signal is now showing five bars and if we look at my phone we can see that we've now gone on to our data signal which is our HSDPA and we're getting minus 85 dBms which is a great cracking signal there for 3G. Now let's do a speed test to see what sort of speeds we're getting here. I go to speedtest.net. It's a great uh, web page that can give you your upload and download speeds. I begin the test. We can see that we're getting a great signal. We're getting almost 4 meg download speed here. Actually, it's because it's 4.6. We're getting the full signal here, 4.6 megs download. And on the upload, we're getting 0.6 about, which is absolutely fine as well. So if I then go back to our signal strength indicator, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch off the cellular apps repeater. And immediately we can see that we lose our signal. And again, if I look at my phone, it takes a while for it to register, but we can see here that we've dropped back to our 2G voice data signal, our edge signal. And um, so we can't use this phone for data now. Just to go through that again, let's switch back on our repeater. And we'll see our 3G signal should be coming up now. And there we have it, full bars in our 3G signal, and our smartphone has gone back onto the uh, HSDPA 3G as well. So there we have it. Okay, so we can see the repeater on the wall here. I'm going to now turn on the power to the repeater. And we can see it's booting up there. On the left, we have our signal strength indicator and LEDs. We have six LEDs which show the strength of the signal. The outside antenna is going to be orientated towards your operator. And the signal strength indicators will increase or decrease depending on how well you have that outside antenna orientated. So at the moment we don't have it orientated very well, we're only getting two bars. So what we're going to do now is we're going to turn the antenna, the outside antenna, to try to get a better uh, signal. There we go. We can Now we can see we've got our six lights lighting up, which is great. And now now we've lost it there, we're going to turn it back to the way it was. There we go. So now we know we're pointing our outside antenna directly towards the operator. And we're getting a blue light, which means we've got a data communication going. If you see the red light come on, don't worry. This is just the repeater tuning itself, reducing the gain to protect the operator's network.